Yo, what is up guys and welcome back to this brand new video. Now, as you can see on the screen, we have got the ultimate screen FIFA 18 guys. And basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about the event. And But yeah, let's get into it. And this is the uh, foot calendar for October. And obviously nothing's really happened at the minute. We've crossed out the days that we've done. And the first day of the event is going to be on the 20th this Friday, guys. So get ready, get your money ready and prepare. Then the last day of the actual cards being in, in packs is going to be next Friday. So not this Friday, but the next one. And then the boosts end. Obviously, the players get boost stats like you, like last year on the Wednesday. So yeah, that's that. And on the screen now, you can see the Ultimate Scream team that was there last year. Now, as you can see, there's many, many different players, and then they obviously got boosted later on on the 28th of October. And as you can see here, most of these players have got like one specific really good, like scary stat. Like, for example, Bellerin has extra pace and Akin Fem was really, really strong. And that is going to be like the players who are going to be in it this year. And then obviously they're, like, they're, they're worse as that, got a massive boost. So for someone like, I think it was, yeah, Lukaku's dribbling went up to 97, which is pretty insane. So that is the screen team. That's what's going to happen. They're going to get boosted for a temporary uh, time and... Uh, yeah, so on the screen now you can see a few cards that I think are going to come. Let's start off with Romelu Lukaku. Look at this normal card. It's decent. It's like an inform. Um, but that boosted card, it is scary. It is very scary. 91 shooting, 94 pace, 97 dribbling and 91 physical. Oh my god, that card would be so, so sick. Next up we have Aubameyang. Now, the reason I think he's going to be in it is because of his scary pace. Now, obviously, his pace will probably go up to 99. And the massive boost will be the physical and the dribbling. that are going to get really high boosts, up to 94 dribbling, 92 shooting, 88 physical. That will be an absolute beast of a card. And then we've got Ericsson, who I think is going to get it because of his passing abilities. Obviously, 90 passing there. And I think he's going to go up to 95 passing. And his stat that gets really boosted will be pace to 90 or 89 pace. So there are just a few ideas of the cards we're going to get. Now I think we're going to go into what's going to happen in the SBCs. So as you can see on the screen, I've edited this from uh, last year's. And we'll have like a screen team. I think it'll probably be for a kit. Probably is going to come. That what happened last year. Last year we had three players in SBCs. We had Douglas Costa, Mario Gaspar, and Dimi Tripiat. And obviously Lukaku's there. Whether he will be in the SBCs, I don't know. But we'll probably have a player, and you have to do a few different challenges for that in the SBCs. So stock up on your 84s maybe for them. And yeah, that's just a shout for the SBCs. Now we're going to get on to the investments. Now this is a big, big chance to make coins. As you can see on the screen, we had trading last year. Last year, I'm using Lukaku as our base player. Now let's just look at PlayStation for a minute. And we'll look at Xbox as well on the graph. So as you can see, the boost day last year was the 28th of October. Now as you can see on the screen, you're probably like, well, why has he gone down on his boost day? Now this is because everyone's gonna be investing to sell on the boost. Now, um, they think they're gonna they're gonna go up because better card, obviously. But this is not gonna happen because there's it, everyone's gonna be panic selling. There's gonna be so many cards on the market going on on the boost day that you're probably better off selling it before. I've got the graph up as you can see, and what as you can see by the graph, it, there's a dip on the 24th, which will be Monday this year, and that's when I'm gonna buy cards. So let's skip to the next one. So yeah. Um, on screen we've got the calendar first day obviously being Friday I think you've got to buy the cards Sunday night, Monday morning because that's when obviously score battles rewards come out and then um, I think I'm going to sell the cards when there's hype around and people are buying them to get the boosted stats on Wednesday-ish Tuesday night, Wednesday so I think that is the time to buy these scary cards and sell them and hopefully make quite a lot of profit then the boost day will happen and the boost will end. Also, I think there might be 
a team of the week SBC. The chances of this are reasonable. If there is, just hang on to like one low rated scream card and something because if he goes up then he will be making you lots and lots of money. So yeah, that's part one of this part three series. Part one is before what's going to happen in part two is what's happening, what I'm buying. Part three is how much money we've made and what's happened. So make sure you hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up, come and get 30 thumbs up, hit subscribe and follow along with this if you want to make a load of coins over the ultimate scream Halloween FIFA 18 uh, promo. So yeah, thanks for watching, subscribe, subscribe and I'm out. See you.